I've ridden since I was a child. We weren't in a place where I could have horses as a kid, so I waited a very long time to have my own barn and my own horses, and I enjoy them a great deal. And so my relationship with horses really is a part of who I am, I think, at this point. I can't imagine not riding, not being with them. It's astounding that I can ask a 1,600-pound animal to do anything, and they'll do it. And I appreciate that every time I walk in the barn, that if this horse doesn't want to do what I ask, it certainly doesn't have to, but yet it does. I was a pre-med and went to the pre-med advisor and said, here, here are my options. I might want to go to medical school, I might want to go to vet school, I might want to go to graduate school in microbiology. And he looked at me and said, well, if you don't know what you want to do, how am I supposed to tell you? Go figure it out and come back and let me know later. And so, of course, I never went back to him again, and that was the end of that. When I came to Bates, it was very important to me to make sure that the students who were interested um, in any kind of health-related career had a place to come and talk about it. I came to Bates sort of with the idea that maybe I wanted to go to vet school. I started thinking about it, I guess, in high school when I rode a horse who had some medical issues that were fascinating to deal with and see how he recovered. It is not true that every 18-year-old knows that they want to go to medical school, whether they say they do or not. Uh, it's, a, of course, an evolution of ideas and, and thoughts and feelings that go into the career decision. So I wanted to make sure that our students had the information and the, the personal context, somebody to talk to about this. We have faculty involved, we have staff involved, and we get the students together in various ways so that they can talk to each other about it. It's fine with me that students go to medical school. It's also fine with me that they don't. If they decide that something else is better for them, then that's part of my job to help them figure that out too. It's essential to an undergraduate's education to have access to that kind of, of, uh, of collaboration where they're in my case, doing science the way science is done uh, beyond Bates. We have students who are interested in doing some good in the world, and they see the health professions as a way to do that. And they're, they're also um, compassionate people. They want to take care of health, and they want to make a difference in people's lives. And, and that's, uh, I think, as, as good as it gets as far as motivation.